Good morning, everyone. Uh, someone in my vlog that I did yesterday suggested that I just take you guys with me for people outside of the US to kind of get a feel for my hometown. I can't exactly tell you where my hometown is, but I can take you to eat with me. And right now we're at a place called Viva, Viva La Chicken. Viva Chicken? It's just Viva Chicken, isn't it? <laughs> Viva Chicken and it's Peruvian rotisserie. <laughs> it's a Peruvian rotisserie chicken and it's super good. There's a few of these around Charlotte. I don't know if they have them outside of North or South Carolina, but uh, we're, we're gonna go inside and get something to eat. I went to Isla Mujer last time in Mexico. In yeah. Mexico. I'm just like starting to do it for fun. It's not like I do it professionally. Yeah, I mean, it's always fun to vlog, man. That's good editing, man. Yeah, I'm just trying, you know. It's, it's for fun. What's up? I'm Cody. It's nice to meet Cody? you. Yeah, good to meet you. What's your name? Kaylee. Kaylee, nice to meet you. I want a whole chicken. Whole chicken. So this place is really, really good, but I think they're trying too hard to be to be modern. The music is just heinous. It's it's like rave music, and what would really set the mood in here, I think, and make it a lot better, is a little lo-fi hip-hop. The three sauces is where it's at in here. You have the yellow sauce, the green sauce, and the red sauce. The red and the yellow sauce, I think, are the best, and I'm not even going to try to pronounce that. God, this music sucks. You, you ever been to an Express for Men, like an Express for Men clothing store? That's what this music is the worst music to relax and have lunch to. It's okay, Viva Chicken, you don't you don't have to be hip. The kids are wrong sometimes. The thing that I sent out on the 12th. All the sauces. Lo-fi, that's all I need, lo-fi. A little bit lo-fi, make, make such, a, such a good experience. Uh, much better experience with lo-fi. Yummy. Are their yuca fries are so good. Mmm, whole chicken. I bet they're good. Ooh, they look good. Sweet potato fries. I don't know what they season this chicken with when they're, well, I mean, Peruvian seasoning, obviously. I don't know what it, what's in it when they do their rotisserie, but it's so freaking good. Definitely aren't gonna use all these sauces when we get a ton of them so we can use them at home the next week because they're super good. Do they rotisserie green beans too? <laughs> they put green beans on little spits? Because they have, they're burned a little bit. They probably cook these rotisserie too. This music really sets the mood for eating. <laughs> yes. That's, that's exactly. <laughs> I had cilantro rice. Get a close up of this delicious Peruvian seasoning. That stuff. That stuff right there. It's delicious. The music, not delicious. The music is heinous. That's not homework. Yes, it is. That's not homework. Uh -huh. Do homework. You're not doing any homework. Mm -hmm. That's not homework. Mm -hmm. It's on the agenda for today. All the charges against Jussie's mullet, Jussie Smollett, were dropped, which is insane because they hit him with what? It was like over 10 federal charges? Huh. Been talking to Cameron Haynes a little bit on Instagram, the, the bow hunter. He was on Logan Paul's podcast and he hung out with Logan Paul and everyone's giving him shit for it. Cameron says that Logan Paul's uh, just a kid, only 23, but he's a nice young man. I'll take Cameron's word for it. Cameron's a pretty awesome guy I look up to. Let's see, at eight o'clock tonight, I'm gonna be playing some Rust with Waylon, who is one of my favorite video game YouTubers right now. He's got some amazing Rust content. He, he tells really, really great stories. He's, He's a good storyteller when he plays Rust. It's pretty cool how he puts his videos together, so check him out. But right now, I'm going to look into why Justy Smollett had all of these felony charges dropped against him. This it's just weird. Oh, hello. Hi. I didn't want to sit near you anyway. I didn't want you to sit near me. I'm glad you're way over there. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. John's at jujitsu, so we have some time to kill. So we're gonna get some coffee. We did get some coffee. We, we did get some you coffee. Fired. White girl coffee. What kind of what kind of super $12 white girl drink do you get? I know, mine was way more expensive. 
I have a venti vanilla chai. Actually, it's a venti vanilla dirty chai latte. Yeah. With soy milk. It has two I, shots in it. I had to do it too. I got a caramelized coffee. <laughs> hey, how was your jiu jitsu? Good. I, 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 Funny sleep. Do what? A woman, a mom, a mom you just one, had your banana. <laughs> what are you talking about? Did you have a good one? Yeah. Yeah? That, I heard a woman's shoe. Yeah. <laughs> That's what you I have your banana. <laughs> But a mom said that? Yeah. Was she talking to you? It, no, no, no. <laughs> Did a random woman walked up to you no, no, and I said, I have your banana? <laughs> no. <laughs> Tell Kaylee that. <laughs> hey, what do I say? Watch for cars, bud. John has something to tell you. Uh oh. What? <laughs> I heard a woman say to her child, <laughs> you were just supposed to no, you, you should have just said to Kaylee, I have a banana. <laughs> I'm so confused. I have a banana. What? <laughs> What's, uh, what happens at the end of this book? They go find their parents in town, but the beginning Indians burn down their house and they have to escape from a house and then they eat bananas. What happens at the end of it though? <laughs> Did, didn't, you, didn't you tell me that grandma dies and the dog and the no! boy use, use grandma no! as a flotation device? No! What are they you reading? They eat bananas! They inflated the bananas! <laughs> they inflated Nana? Haley, wait. <laughs> You're gonna ruin the banana. Uh, that's what I want. Ow. <laughs> Ow. Ow. Got him. Well, that's the end of the vlog. I would probably make it longer and talk about some more stuff, but it's already 7:10, and I will be streaming on Twitch with Waylon, who is, like I said, is an awesome Rust YouTuber, and I need to go practice some Rust and try to throw this vlog together and get it out before then. So, everyone, please have a fantastic day.